so hello everyone welcome to the channel so in this video i'm going to show you how to add a shape file into uh, rgis online so now let's get started so to add a shape file into rgis online first we have to navigate this option called add section here and in that i'm going to click this option and uh, we have these two different options called add a layer from url or add a layer from file so i'm going to click this option called add a layer from file so now a new window pop up saying add layer so you can add your layer from your device, Google Drive, Dropbox and OneDrive. And this particular option is only available in the paid version. So in the free version, you can export the supported file formats are CSV, GeoJSON and KML. But in the paid version, it supports GeoPackage, Microsoft Excel, File GeoDatabase and Shapefile and Service Definition. So you can upload a shapefile from your device, Google Drive, Dropbox or OneDrive. So now I'm going to upload my shapefile from my device. So before uploading our shapefile into RGIs online, first we have to compress our shapefiles in zip file format. So let me show you that, how to do that. So this is the shapefile I want to compress and I want to export, uh, uh, import into RGIs online. So I'm going to select this particular uh, shapefiles and I'm going to right click and click this option called uh, compress and mail. So once you did that, a window pop up saying archive name and parameters. So we're going to select the archive format to be zip file format and uh, browse to a suitable location where you could like to uh, copy this particular compressed file. And after that, we're going to click this option called OK. So new, uh, now we have our compressed file, shape file here. So we have uh, named as data. So now I'm going to import uh, this particular data into RGIs online. So let me get back to RGIs online. So now we're going to click this option called your device. And now navigate to the folder location where you compressed your shape file. So now I have navigated to my uh, folder location where I have compressed my file. So this is my file called data. So I'm going to click this. And I'm going to click this option called open. So once I did that, uh, again it's going to show us the file is data, uh, data.zip. And the file format uh, it is in shape file. A vector data storage for format for storing location, shape, attributes of geographic feature. The shape file is stored in a set of related files and uh, contains one feature class. So you can uh, save, it, uh, save it either as a shape file or the file geodatabase. So for now, we're going to save it as a shape file. And we're going to click this option called next. So now the title I'm going to mention as US uh, counties. And uh, now I'm going to add a tag to this particular uh, shape file. For example, I'm going to mention as a USA. And followed by I'm going to mention another tag called counties. And followed, I'm going to mention as a boundary as uh, my third uh, ta tag. So I'm going to mention as boundary. So uh, to add this uh, third tag, I'm going to click enter. And last, we have to add some summary to our shape file. So a short description about this particular shape file. For example, I'm going to mention as USA counties. So now I have mentioned the, in summary, I have mentioned the US county. So you can add some more description to your shape file. And the next step, I'm going to click this option called create and add to map. So now it's going to upload our data, our shape file into RGIs online. So now here you can able to visualize, we have managed to order, add our shape file into RGIs online. So we are currently viewing the shape file we have uploaded into RGIs online. So you can able to see that. So now we managed to uh, add the shape file into RGIs online. So now you can able to view the layers. I'm gonna navigate to this option called layers. And in the layers section, you can able to see we have US county boundary. And I'm gonna click this option. So we have this uh, options called zoom to the layer. For example, I'm gonna zoom out. And uh, I'm gonna click this option called zoom to layer. So it's gonna zoom to layer this particular features. And the next option is uh, show properties. So uh, you can able to see the properties. So you can make some uh, color to this particular uh, boundary. That is this particular shape file. So to do that in the symbology section, I'm going to click this option called edit layer, edit layer style. Now here I'm going to select this particular option. First option is choose attributes. And the second option is pick a style. So I'm going to click this option. So here I'm going to click this option to select a suitable color of your choice here. 
so for example we're going to select a different color to it so we're going to select the green color to it so we're going to click done and done so likewise you can change the color of this particular shape file so the next option is uh, show table so it's going to open the attribute table of this particular shape file so these are the following attributes table that is available in this shape file here you can able to see that let me close this and the next option is uh, you can rename you can save this and you can duplicate this particular uh, shape file and you can remove this file so in this video I have shown you how to uh, add a shape file into RGI's online so thanks for watching and make sure that you subscribe to our channel and give us a like